and then you're going to pick the wallpaper you want. So you're going to go to System Preferences, Desktop, and Screensaver. And then you can pick any one you want to have the login background. So for this purpose, we're going to use this one right here. And then once you select it, you're going to drag it to your desktop. And then you can change your wallpaper back to what it was. Then you're going to go to Macintosh HD. Go to System, Library, Core Services. And right here, you see a folder called defaultdesktop.jpg. So the, what you're going to do now is you're going to right-click on rocks.jpg or whatever it was. You're going to press Get Info. And you're going to have to name it exactly what it says right here, even with the capitals and everything. So D-E-F-A-U-L-T, capital D-E-S-K-T-O-P, dot J P. G. Then we're going to press enter. And now the name of the file has changed. And then the next thing you're going to do is drag it in your course services. And it says this item desktop default desktop.jpg cannot be moved because it's in the core services. Press this and you're going to press replace. If it doesn't ask you to replace it, it means you did something wrong. You're going to type in your computer password and it should be right here. So to check if this works, let's log out right now. And you're not going to hear any audio right now, but I'll be right back. So as you can see, it worked perfectly. You can change it with any desktop you want. You just have to download it from the website and do exactly what it says. Make sure the file is on your desktop and rename it drag it in, press, put your password, and that's it. it. Every time you restart your computer, it should be like that. If you ever want to change it, do the opposite. Go back and just change with this wallpaper right here. All right, thanks for watching. If you have any questions on this or you'd like to suggest a topic, please email me or PM me on YouTube. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.